The rising cattle market has breathed a little life into the ranching industry. If the price of beef is truly a result of supply and demand, the markets should hold for another year or two. One thing we know for sure, what goes up will come down. What will you do when your calves are worth half as much as they are today? There are only two choices, cut costs or increase income. One of the alternatives that has caught the attention of some cattlemen is the sharply growing demand for natural grass-fed beef. Although it requires some extra attention and creative marketing, this can add to your bottom line if you have the right genetics. Here's what I mean. When we raised our first grass-fed beef several years ago, I kept some steers from my 1,600-pound hay burner cows. Those steers were three years old and 1,600 pounds before they started to show some finish. That does not work financially. What does work is the early maturing grass-efficient PCC genetics with fleshing ability and marbling. You will find that PCC calves will finish in less time on less feed than status quo beef. Here's a couple of thoughts that could help you break into grass-fed beef. Number one, buy a PCC bull. We have 30 years of grass-developed genetics that will get you started off right. There are grass-fed producers finishing PCC calves in 18 months or less. Number two, start small. Begin by offering samples. A few sliders at a farmer's market will go a long way to gather some interest. Number three, rather than trying to sell halves or quarters, try selling a box of various cuts in smaller amounts. Most people don't have the time, money, or knowledge to manage a freezer full of beef. Number four, on a larger scale, there are grass finishers in the Faro network that are looking for PCC calves to fill their pastures. If you're a customer, that information is available to you in the discussion group. There are 180 forage-developed bulls selling in Burlington, Colorado next Monday, April 15th. For more info, go to pharaohcattle.com. I'll see you next time on the Herd Quitter Minute. <music>